Among those hoping to hear their name when the Oscar envelopes are open Sunday is a San Diego State Film School graduate who's no stranger to controversy. New at 5.30, our tennis reporter Michael Chen reveals how that controversy nearly crushed his Oscar hopes. In the film The Insult, a dispute in Beirut over a broken water pipe between a Christian mechanic and a Palestinian refugee turns ugly and violent. The ensuing legal drama threatening a social explosion in a divided country. The force behind the film, director and co-writer Ziad Doeri, emigrated from Lebanon in 1983 before enrolling in San Diego State's film school, where he pushed the envelope. And I was not conservative. I always wanted to say more, which caused me clashes with some of the, with some of the teachers. Clashes that shaped him as he became a filmmaker. It like cement your belief or your, your faith that this is what you want to do. What he's done is have a long career in movies, directing four feature films exploring provocative topics in the Middle East. One of those films banned in nearly two dozen countries after he broke laws forbidding him from going to Israel to shoot the movie. I was very hurt. You know when we work on film, Michael, we work for years on it. Doeri says his next film, The Insult, was nearly banned again for the old grievance before he got support from Lebanon's prime minister and others. If that support had not come, he would not have been able to submit the movie for Best Foreign Film Oscar, the first ever nomination for Lebanon. When we got the nomination, I just sat down and I said, you know what? Yeah, this is the way to go. Like we scored a goal. It became about... The difficulty that we over that we overcame. In two days, the journey filled with challenges will land in L.A., where Zoeri will attend his first Oscars. I cannot have any expectations. Uh, you know, it's we're, we're there, and then you let destiny decide for you. Michael Chen, 10 News. And we have an entire section about the Oscars on our website. Go to 10news.com and click on Entertainment. There, you can find a full list of the nominees plus a list of Oscar viewing parties in San Diego.